Manchester City had a fantastic campaign last year where they broke numerous records on way to winning the Premier League. This season, however, Manchester City kick off their title defence with a tough trip to Arsenal. Manchester City experienced a mixed bag of a pre-season due to several of their players not being available for selection. However, the last weekend, S2-0 victory against Chelsea certainly shows that Pep Guardiola's men will be ready for the challenge against Arsenal and will try to replicate their title-winning form. Pep Guardiola will most likely opt for a 4-3-3 formation. Ederson Morrisederson had an amazing season last year for Manchester City and the Brazilian and the city management will be hoping that the same will continue. The Brazilian will be a definite starter for the Sunday S game against Arsenal. His distribution skills, calmness, and composure while playing out from the back, the ability to organize the defense will be essential to the way Manchester City will play at Emirates against Arsenal. Defenders Benjamin Mendy, Americ Laporte, John Stones, Kyle Walker Benjamin Mendy in defense Benjamin Mendy with his bombarding runs and decent defensive skills look certain to start in the left-back position. John Stones and Americ Laporte in the centre-back position, John Stones and Americ Laporte look certain to start especially after helping Manchester City in keeping a clean sheet against Chelsea which ultimately led to Manchester City winning the Community Shield match last weekend. Kyle Walker Kyle Walker with his marauding forward runs and excellent defensive attributes will be the first choice for the right-back position against Arsenal on Sunday. Midfielders Phil Foden, Fernandinho, Kevin De Bruyne Phil Foden in the midfield, Phil Foden could start for Manchester City against Arsenal after his impressive performance against Chelsea last weekend. The teenager had a very good game as provided the assist for Aguero's opener and time and again was driving through the midfield and distributing the ball efficiently to his teammates who were in advanced positions. Fernandinho Fernandino will be taking his position in the role of a defensive midfielder position. The Brazilian has made this position his own and will be a certainty for City in this position not only in this match but throughout the season provided he is fully fit. Kevin De Bruyne Kevin De Bruyne missed out on the clash against Chelsea, but he is fully expected to start against Arsenal at the Emirates on Sunday. Kevin De Bruyne is most likely to be entrusted with his most favoured role i.e. a free roam with a licence to attack thereby making him a real threat. Attackers Leroy Sane, Sergio Aguero, Riyad Mahrez Leroy Sane Leroy Sane is likely to start at Arsenal despite not having a very good game against Chelsea last weekend. The German despite not having his best game, has shown on many occasions that he can be a game-changer, especially against the top sides. Sergio Aguero Sergio Aguero will continue to play in the striker position. The Argentinian striker scored twice at Wembley against Chelsea last weekend, thereby proving that he still has the skill and desire to be the main striker for City this season despite many people writing him off and preferring Gabriel Jesus over him. Riyad Mahrez Riyad Mahrez on the other hand, unlike Leroy Sane, had a very good game. He troubled the Chelsea defence on many occasions and will definitely be staking the claim to start at the Emirates. Topics you might be interested in